Oh, oh yeah. Ah. Ah. What's up, everyone? What's up, early birds? You know what they say, the early bird gets the... Oh no, my overlay. There we go. I fucking love After we stuff. reached 5,000 Pudsy prayers, it gave me a bunch of good luck, you see? Yeah, you gotta pray to your Pudsy. What am I drinking? Uh, I am out of wine, so um, and, and good alcohol, so I'm drinking my sussy whiskey, Chitra's whiskey, which says it is high in peated malt, because that's what you wanna read on a whiskey label. Just fill my whiskey full of peat. Oh, so good. Fran, thank you for the 22 months. Every day and wake up and thank God we have Goya. <sighs> Dude, I, 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 I thought he was dead. Love not. So I was just like, oh, okay, no stream today then. I guess we do it tomorrow. And then like, he puts together the sheet in literally five minutes. I fucking love not. Uh, oh yeah. Yes, happy birthday, Pogo. Mudo, thank you for the 16 months. Pogo, thank you for the 12 months. It's my birthday, happy birthday. Goya, my beloved, yeah. Yeah, it's a good thing we didn't let him out of the basement. I fucking oh. love knobs. Oh, that's good whiskey. Simon, why with the if you can for the how will and the when is the yes? Absolutely. But, you know, I know a lot of people might disagree with this decision, but I say I absolutely love knobs. Ah. Styler, thank you for the eight months. And Jay Pritchard, thank you for the two months. Ah. I fucking uh, top love ramen. Thank knobs. you for the 26 months. Let's fucking go. Ah, beautiful. Happy birthday, Pago. Ah. Ah. What's up, everyone? How's everybody doing? This room is in fucking shambles since the server build. Like, it doesn't look really messy from like where the camera is, but like. Bro, look over there. Look over there, there's so much shit. And there's like shit you don't see that's like directly behind me. It's, uh, it's oof. It's big oof. Large, large oofs. How's everybody's weekends going? Cleaning stream next week? That uh, depends, maybe the server comes in. Like, I'm, I've given up on like cleaning my house until I'm done with my server build. How will Kate fit? Don't worry. Kate is small. She'll fit. Are you sick? I'm a little bit stuffy, but like otherwise I'm okay. I'm still a wee bit stuffy. Wait, I thought we were getting cut today. Yeah, me too. I was kind of looking forward to it, but then Goya actually did the links like five minutes before normal stream time. So yeah, it feels bad. All right, let's see what Goya says. Sorry for the delay, I usually deal with this in the morning, but today I'm extra busy. Well, I fucking Thank love you, Goya. Knobs. We love you. Ah, uh, the fucking, the hero we do not deserve. Dark, thank you. Where did the hat stains come from? Uh, from ultraviolet radiation. And I probably spilled something on it. I should probably wash this someday. You, like, I, 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 I think I should wash this. <laughs> I think I've tried to wash it and it still looked like this, so. I probably washed it with like a brown towel that just, once you wash it and it falls apart. Oh God, that'd be terrible. Embrace sweat, don't wash hats. Yep, absolutely. Ah, oh, that's good. Oh, that's nice. Oh, dude, I, I have random, this is just randomly on my desk. I have like ram stick 
storage. I have a GPU right there. I have 64 gigs of ECC registered if somebody needs it, by the way, because apparently the server doesn't take registered. It needs to be unbuffered. Fuck you. <sighs> Feels fucking bad. Thought you built your server. Uh, turns out I don't have space for 12 drives in that case. So like I stacked up a bunch of drives using like rubber mounting and then like the leftovers were like on the side and like they're pushing up against the PCI card in there and that's probably not good. <clears throat> so I bought a case for it from Germany and then I realized it was the wrong size case. So I emailed them to cancel my order and bought a for you from somewhere else. They emailed me back like after three days telling me, hey, sorry, we can't cancel your order. It's too late. It's already said. I fucking so, uh, love So, see you there. Uh, Oxy, thank you for the two years of this shit. Yep. All right, let's 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 see what we got. Exclamation links. Oh, yeah. Boom. I Boom. fucking love knobs. Wait. I fucking love knobs. Where's the good meme? Where's the good meme? Ooh, Frank, thank you for redeeming Simon Sells Out and reminding me that I have to disable Gator Dance I because you're getting it for free love today. love knobs. Wait, where will you fit a for you rack server? Same place. I fucking I put love the knobs. Thing. It's on the floor. Why would you redeem Dance when it's free? I'm just like, I'm gonna give you free I shit. And then you're like, quick, everybody knobs. buy it. I don't need, I don't need to fucking spend money to get I fake views. I got real views. Knobs. I got the best fucking community on the planet. There you go. Make the numbers bigger. Fuck you and your big numbers. Also, stock fans will be loud as fuck. There will be no stock fans. I got static pressure optimized stock tours that are compatible. All right, uh, I'll do the sellout in a little bit. Gentle, thank you for the 16 months. Knobs. All right, waiting for hot take season two. You know, Lewis is back. Lewis do be back. You know what that means. Simon, there are some keyboard kits that are gasket with no screws securing the plate and hot swap PCB together. I will have issue with three pin switches being pushed out of the PCB. Oh, I have issues with three pin switches being pushed out of the PCB. Will five pin fix it? Not hugely. I mean, yes, it depends on the PCB. Uh, if the five pin pins are large enough to like securely just like be shoved in there and get stuck in there, good. But if their PP is small and they just slip right out, then yeah. Wow. Yay. Wait, how do I have 45 viewers? I had like 70 a minute ago. How did I drop 30 viewers instantly? Question mark? You're at 103? Oh, it says 45 for me. Okay. Well, thanks, OBS. All right. Uh, let, me, let me do a quick sellout. Uh, those of you that are here, absolutely fucking know that this is a not-for-profit stream. Uh, I have no sponsors. I don't take money from anyone. I don't take free review units. I, you know, I'm very nice. I'm very polite. When I take your mom out for dinner, I call her the next day. All that shit. So if you want to you wanna help support the stream so we're no longer down 1,600 bucks, you can sub, you can do Patreon, you can donate, you can do whatever the fuck you want. And you don't have to, okay? But if you like the content, you want to support, there's a lot of ways to support. DM me and be like, hey, Simon, I want to support. You know, there's lots of ways to fucking help out. You know, you can be part of the recap team. You know, the recap team I hear is uh, is, is uh, doing just fine. Just fine. Don't worry about the recap team. They're fine. Everything is fine. How do you unlock Gatoron Kiss and Simon Sellout? You do exclamation redeem and then space, and then you can do kiss, you can do dance, you can do sellout, you can do uh, other shit probably. All right, let's go. 
We have three whole ICs this week. It's massive, huge, huge, massive, just the largest. Okay, I don't believe you. I have trust issues now when people give me DBO, DBO key links. I fucking love not. Hello, cuck. I slept another 18 hours. How was your weekend? It's good. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. I, I thought stream was canceled, so I may or may not have just, like eaten a very large cookie before the stream. So I'll see you there. Where the fuck did all the ICs go? In, he in hell. No, don't rain, please. My house, like, th there's like no place to even stand. All right, let's go. Funky 60. It is a 60% with a funky, normal, Alice 40, and ortho slant layouts. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Well, he's got a banana mat. I respect that. I hate this. Okay? It's very rare when I look at something and I'm just like, you know what? I hate this. I hate this, bro. Okay, like, okay. You can do like non-sus layouts. Show me, show me the layout support. Show me the layouts. There we go. All right, so you can have a normal 60, cool. You can do an Alice 40 in a 60 case, which why the fuck would you do that? Orthos land in a standard 60 case. Why would you do that? Funky? Okay, at least, you know. It's the big brain method because, you know, it's known, it's well known that if you produce, it, like if you CNC a keyboard in China, they will put the plate backwards on 100% of the time. 100% of the time. Even if like it's keyed, so it only goes in one way, they're gonna fucking make it fit. So I love the, you know, the, the Chinese menu layout as well as the normal layout. The others, oof, not so much. All right. Oh, it's Jack. God damn it. See, you outed yourself. Now I'm going to be biased. Now I'm going to be biased. It's through hole. I fucking love through hole. You might be wondering why such a That that is not spelled right. Yeah, that is not spelled right, my dude. Okay. I know the funky layout might not be for everyone, so I wanted to include that. Okay, fine. Design language, I don't care. That's, 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 that's it. Okay, so brass bottom, nice big feet, gasket mounted, uses a, oh, whatever, They're, these are called Pro Micro, Large Micro, Elite C, whatever the fuck. You, you know what I mean, it's a Pro Micro. That's a very interesting way of plugging into the PCB though. That is very interesting. Oh, and it's 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 like hot dog style gasket. It's like uh, uh, NWO 5000 style gasket. Wait, is this gas, is, yeah, this is gasket, right? You said gasket. Yeah, gaskets. Oh, that's O-ring mounted? Okay, so like pressure fit to the top, like kind of like the CE type. Okay. Okay. Carrying case included, kind of wild. Okay, 7.3 degrees, a little high for me, but fine. 3.7 pounds assembled, please use metric. It is 1.66 repeating built. Okay, that's cute, that's cute. All right, you got a target price? No phone, yay. Uh, no? No target price? Jack, there is price, really? Am I blind? Target is $206. That is very specific. Okay. 
check IC in the thread. What? What do you mean check IC in the thread? You mean read the comments? Oh, you mean IC form. No, there's nothing here either. Hey, I'm not blind, okay? I just, I got something in my eye, okay? Okay? For the record, okay? You guys like you guys like to talk shit, okay? Here. This is what I'm fucking staring at. Okay? Would you be able to see with that? Would you? It's fucking bright, dude. Sounds like skill issue. Uh-uh. Wow. Click the product link. There's a product link? Okay, you guys are fucking with me at this point. Scroll down the IC form old man. Okay. That's just so mean. $206, okay. I'll take it, I'll take it for $206. Like for $206, do I wanna do through hole on an aluminum and brass board that has like this layout? No, absolutely fucking not. But I will give it an okay hand. Cause for the price point, fuck it. What else do you have? Yeah. Yeah. The OG. The OG. Honestly, through hole is fine. I don't mind through hole. That's a good cat. That's a good cat right there. Oh yeah, that's a fucking nice kitty right there. Yeah. Pat. Pat, pat. All right, I've seen enough. I've seen enough. This is a huge fucking meme board. Then again, everything that Jack makes is kind of memes, so. Eh. It's nice that the hobby's like coming back to its roots. Momo's artisan tray. Okay. Okay, it's $67. That's $2 cheaper than what I would consider nice. Uh... All right, show me your proto. Why, why did you fill it with honey? Is that the tears of your enemies? Okay, okay, that, that's not bad. It's, it's got a little bit going on, it's interesting. You know, you got engraving and whatnot. It's got an, you sure it's honey? God damn it, it's water. Simon, is the hobby dying? No, absolutely not. You know, this looks fun. Okay, so 67 bucks for this. It does 11 artisan slots. It's not terrible. Honestly, it's not terrible. This looks fine. Fuck it. Like that looks decent. Yeah, that looks all right. I feel like for like weirdly shaped artisans, they might not fit in there, but it looks good. It looks good. I'll take it. I'll take it. Went through multiple prototypes, so it's not a fucking cash grab. Two colors, the man knows what he wants. Fulfillment time is fine. Yeah, this is fine, fuck it. Why the Pokeball? Why not? Fuck it. At least, you know, at least he didn't you know, write an introduction where he explains what Pokemon is. I'll give this an okay hand. But art of all of your artisans will get wet. They're already wet, baby. Ah. All right, classic TKL. Hmm, something tells me this is gonna be a rectangle. Hello, oh, it's Monster here. Okay, 
So Monster Gear is known for making like $100 keyboards to like $200 keyboards. And now they're coming in and saying, give me 470 to $500 for a keyboard. So let's let's see what you're bringing to the table at that price point. Okay, it's a rectangle. Okay. It's got acrylic diffusers. It's got what looks like a relatively thin external weight. And that's it. That anno looks not great. This looks like the sus, oh, it is Korea. Okay, it is Korea. Like you, you can see how it's splotchy over here. And that's the anno, that's not like fingerprints or anything. Oh, okay. Let's go check out their site. Sounds like a ping monster. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Most Korean boards just sound like ass cheeks. I know, I know, that's a hot take. I'll save it for hot take season two. And 45 bucks for shipping. So in the end, you're paying like $550 for a Monster Gear keyboard. I, uh, no, no, no. I, I don't see a single fucking person in which this makes sense. Four. Like I can't imagine a single person which like this would be a good board slash good value for. Bro, it's Monster Gear. It's like KBD fans making like a $650 premium TKL, but with like the same finishing and quality control you're used to. Yeah, this is... Is it just fixed? Oh no, no it's not because I'm certain if I go to UAE it's gonna be like a bajillion dollars. Oh no, it's just 50, okay. I have an ass cheek Monster Gear keyboard. That's, that's the spirit. It's Bluetooth, I believe, yeah. I mean, does, does that like, is that worth the additional $200 that this is overpriced by? No. It's worth like $5 more. Unless the battery comes with it, then like $15 more. <sighs> yeah, no, absolutely fucking not. This ain't it, Chief. This is absolutely not it, Chief. I'm, I'm giving this a spoon, not even a newspaper, because these guys have built enough boards to know. Like this is too little, too late, by somebody that shouldn't have made the fucking thing in the first place and too expensive. Like you've completely missed the mark on this one. Like n not even fucking close. Like I feel like this is something that like started like getting worked on in like 2020 when like everybody was like fondling the balls of keyboard makers. There was a lot of ball fondling going on. I feel like this is something that was designed then with the intention of it going out then, but like something happened and they didn't get it out until now. Yeah, yeah, two kilos is light. It's not like stupid light, but it is light for a board of this price. <sighs> yeah, I'm not loving this. I am absolutely not loving this. All right, let's go into group buy. As heavy as a Keychron Q3 without weight, yep. Yeah. yeah, kind of sussy wussy, isn't it? Ah. Let me just finish this whiskey before getting into group buys. Hello, Simone. Hello. Safa is lighter though. Yeah, but Safa is not meant to be a heavy board. It's based on the KFE. The KFE is not a heavy board. We're already on group buys. There were three ICs, dude. We're 27 minutes into this stream. How much do you think I can milk it? I'm not a big milker. Not a big milker. Why am I getting pinged in? Okay, that's why I'm getting pinged. Oh yeah, I'm all about the big milker. Oh, okay. Uh, 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 there, you guys can see me type. Uh, have you tried camel milk? I have not. 
All right, Amano, round two. I feel like we've covered this. I feel like we just covered this. Let's go to the recap sheet. Oh, feels like it was written, right? Yeah, we literally covered it last week as a group buy. Okay. Updated pricing? Did it change? Did he drop the pricing? Ooh. Okay. Okay. So last week, I said price point is too high. So the buy score is very hesitant. However, the entire board is open source. You can make your own, which is nice. The simple fact that they were able to drop the price 100 bucks means they should have dropped the price 100 bucks before hitting group buy. I don't think it's a full 100 bucks. Because, like, the frost, I think, was like 440 or something. I think this is a decent. I think this is. Relatively decent. 400 bucks in stock, Alice. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. That is not bad at all. Uh, like, I know I gave it a buy last week, but it was a hesitant buy. I'll give it a less hesitant buy. Like, at 400 to like 445 for an Alice, that's good. That's the price point that an Alice should be at. And like, it's in stock, which is like fucking amazing. Like, I know that, like, the MGA and, like, cheaper things exist, but, like, for, like, a, an Alice tier Alice, that's more or less the price point that you're shooting for. All right, let's get some more whiskey in the whiskey glass. Oh. Ah, oh, the sussiest of whiskeys. So good. Love sussy whiskeys. Oh, it's getting slightly toasty in the room. This was in stock at 100 more. I don't think it's 100 more. Like, it dropped a little bit. It dropped about 10%. No, not that 69. It's teacher's whiskey. All right. Yep. It was 100 more, was it? Holy shit. Yeah. Somebody, uh, somebody was trying to to bite off a large piece. Well, you see? I mean, the, the like, it's not that the hobby is dying, the market is healed, you know? The market is a lot better, to the point where like, you know, if something is too expensive, people are not gonna buy it anymore, which is nice. That's how the world should fucking work. All right, let's go. TGR Jane V2ME and TGR 910 V2ME, crimson, red, fuck I want. Give me. What is it? Twenty seventh of January. What day is that? Fuck. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Honestly, I kind of like the nine, the red nine ten. All right. Is is there? Uh, there's no pricing, but it was like four fifty five, right? Uh, crimson, silver box. Yeah. Any price written anywhere? I don't think so. There's pricing on the overview page. Well, it'd be fucking great if it was on this page. I'm going to assume it's the same as the previous ME and the previous 910, which like had buys. So here's. Do I scroll more or do I click? Okay, there we go. Yeah. Yeah, that's the same as before. And I think that's the same as before. <sighs> All right. So listen, you guys know how I feel about TGR. Absolutely do not try to enter this raffle, okay? Everybody just sleep in because 
daddy's not gonna lose his fourth 910 group buy raffle, okay? N nobody enter this, it is terrible. Like, l look at that enter, it's crooked, it's obviously a broken keyboard. Nobody, nobody wants to buy that, you know? Like, try, try, try for the Jane. I think the Jane might be a better play value-wise because the 910 kind of overrated, you know? There's been lots of nine, like, like top right blocker 65s for a long time. So like, just skip this one, you know, just skip it. Just, just like, just sleep through the raffle period and you're good, okay? And I promise I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna totally sleep through the raffle period. Is there a wing keyless on the 910? I don't think there ever was. The red is nice, but I I prefer a deeper red. So this is 187C, I prefer 188C. But like this is this is a comfy red. I think he's trying to trick us. I I I'm absolutely not. I am I am no bamboozle, no ruse. No hoodwinking, straight, absolute truth, 103%. 9-10 is Pog, will consider it, absolutely do not. Yeah, let's get to Simon. It's nice, the TGR is still making boards. And it's nice that people can actually buy them. It's great. Oh. Why are you liking it so much? Uh, because I have every other TGR that I want, except for the 910. And I tried for the CE, I tried for the SE, I tried for the ME, I tried for every single one except for the GAF, because fuck, fuck the GAF. And I'll enter this one and give it a shot and probably lose yet again. The MKBHD YouTube channel got a very early red TGR Jane V2 ME. I freaked out when I saw it. That's not good. That's not good. I, unless they like, didn't mention it at all. Like at, at that point, okay. But like, s stop sending boards to big guys. You're gonna fuck up the hobby again. We're gonna get a bunch of normies. We're gonna have fucking Holy Panda field typing test all over again. Do they talk? Cause I'm not gonna listen. Oh no, mechanical keyboard discussion. Okay, pull it out, show it to me. Fuck. Fuck. No, so many people have seen this. We're so fucked. We're so fucked. Why? Fuck. God damn it. Caleb, you fucked us. You dick. Way to fucking alienate like the core audience that actually cares about keyboards. <sighs> How many views? 154,000. Downvote the vid, you're right. You're right, every little bit matters. I dislike this. <sighs> Fuck, why? why? Why have you done this? I mean, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna lose my fourth fucking 910 raffle. They'll be too focused on the TKL, you're wrong. They're gonna go for the cheaper one. Normies always buy like the cheapest like usable board, which is why 60% were always so big because the entry point, the entry price point was lower than TKLs. That's what pushed the like the the great expansion of the hobby was the low price and availability of 60%. You know, all the purists back, you know, 2017, 2018, 2019, like all the purists, the pros were all TKL, but all the normies were buying fucking 60s and 65s. So, we might be fucked. Downvoting a video is still an engagement and it helps the algorithm. I know. I know it does. Chihi types even commented on it. 
like with words or did he stream for the first time in three years? Is it allowed to enter a raffle as a proxy for a friend? If you don't mention all the words that you just did, yes. But the second... Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll simplify this. It's only illegal if you get caught. Kind of just like every other law. Okay. That's a, that's a, that's a pro-life tip right there. Okay. Nothing is truly illegal unless you get caught. All right. We've got the, the, the fuckeroo 6G. Designed by Fuyu.u. Okay. Okay, pictures. So it's a screwless 60%. And also there's a TKL, what the fuck? What is this? Oh, you're just showing us the color. Okay. Champagne gold. Yeah, that's just gold, my dude. All right. So it's doing HG-ish side, screwless, like all the all the terrible memes. It's got four mount points, gasket, or I assume you can top mount as well. All right, so price point. Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me, what the actual fuck? Yeah, no, 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 uh-uh. Wait, how, how much, uh, wait, it was 690 uh, SGD, All right, so the the literal TGR, like, like TGR 65% board was $522. You wanna charge $482 for like the sussiest fucking 60 I've ever seen as a nobody. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. All right. No, absolutely fucking not. Bro, like it's it's not that this is high for 150 units. This would be high for like 20 units. This would un like this would honestly be high for 20 units based on like looking at the design. That's fucking high, dude. Like the design doesn't have much going on. Like it's a single through way. And yeah, I get, oh yeah, a CNC machine had to like cut out some things. Yeah, 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 I got you. It's still too fucking expensive. So yeah, uh, no. Quality expectations, no scratches on outside for A stock. Oh, so I scratches on the inside qualify as A stock? Slight anodization variation. Possible scratches on internal areas. So literally you're telling me it's sussy and then you're telling me you want $500 for this. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. Yeah, no. Also, Rain, thank you for the 19 months. <sighs> so I'm in any tips on what to do with a plate with super tight switch cutouts? Do you, do you, do you enjoy that shit? You, you, you push it in there until your thumbs are fucking bleeding and you get a fucking rock hard erection the I entire time love because dogs. you know that your plate is securely holding your switches. You don't ever gotta fucking worry about it. You can even use fucking hot swap if you want. Scott, thank you for the 32 months. That's like 31 months and like another month. All right, Zoom 65 Essential Edition V2. All right. So this is probably equally sussy to the thing that we last saw, except this is gonna be like a fifth of the price. All bottom cases are electrospade sparkling black, which cannot be seen from the outside. All top cases are electrostatic sprayed except silver. Yeah, I got it. So new colorways, four new colors. You've got 
Ivory Cream, Cyber Yellow, GT Silver, and Teal. That is not teal, my dude. I mean, I guess it's deep teal. Perky RGB, fuck yeah. Seamless top case, fuck yeah. Backplate, absolutely. New PCB with DB. New stabs and sleeve gaskets, also known as condoms. Nice. 14 different case colors, yeah. Give me the faint blur pull. Oh, so good. And you got nine weight options. It's kind of insane. And knob options, okay. 14 extra black back plates. Okay, and carbon fiber is an option. Carbon fiber is always nice to have on the bottom of a board. Okay, so give it to me. How many monies? 175 bucks. Wait, aluminum weight and knob. Okay, so you gotta spend 195 bucks to get like the PVD. That seems pricey compared to their Zoom TKL, doesn't it? Because Zoom TKL was 180 bucks, right? Yeah. What made this so expensive all of a sudden? Like, okay, new new PCB, but was there already a Zoom 65? You would have done a new PCB for this anyway. So like, what's what's pushing up the price this high? Like, I expected this to be like 165. I will take this at 165. I'm not okay with this at 195, honestly. Not because like, you're not gonna get a decent value at 195, you absolutely still are. But at 195, this is more expensive than the Zoom TKL, which is kind of weird. The logistics of having 5 million different combinations probably don't help, not necessarily inflation in the past three weeks. Inflation has come down over the last three weeks. As a matter of fact, inflation has been on a downward trend for two quarters now. Except you're in like, except in like Turkey and like Venezuela. Didn't previous Zoom 65s come with switches and keycaps? I have no fucking idea, my dude. Maybe Seamless needs more material and CNC time? No. 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 Because doing a top and a... Uh, doing a dedicated top and a dedicated bottom means your source aluminum needs to be at least twice the size. It means that during the shaving down phase where like you CNC the entire thing and then like bring the level down, that would need to happen twice, whereas now it only needs to happen once. Uh, there'd probably be less tool changes, it'd be less mo like actual like material changes. No, this is cheaper, to, this is cheaper to make. I fucking love knobs. Backplate added? Yeah, but that costs nothing. The backplate is a, probably a stamped 1.5 mil. At, at worst, it's a CNC 1.5 mil, which you get that in sheets already. So like you can absolutely just finish the entire sheet and then machine after the fact. So this, like this part costs like a dollar at their MOQs. Maybe like $2 if we're pushing it. That's material cost, machining cost, and finishing cost. Like there are ways to get that price point low if you're going with like sheet thin. And also unlucky, thank you for the 21 months. Yeah, I'm gonna give this a don't buy. Don't buy it at this price point, buy this at 165. It'll come down to 165 and then you can buy it. Probably stamp because it's more effective and cheaper. Yeah, but the like buying a stamping machine costs money. And if you already have CNCs, the amount of time required to CNC a 1.5 mil sheet is not much because it's a sheet. You don't have to hollow out the middle. You essentially just cut this out and the piece falls through. So like the CNC time is like nothing. You could theoretically laser it too. With alu, okay, maybe not. If it was steel, you could laser it. All right, let's go. Ori CLS three slash slash eight eight. Okay. You can't stamp carbon fiber or glass. I mean, you most can. You most. You can most certainly try. All right, Ori CLS. I never liked the first one. Let's see what the new one is bringing to the table. Is it cheap? How many monies? All right, so 300 units, 
$616. Do not buy. That's it. That's it. $616. This is more expensive than the TGRJ. Founders Edition is $12.50 US dollars. For that, it better be like 316 stainless. 316 L stainless with like a one of one finishing. Yeah, no, this is this is a fucking joke. This is an absolute fucking joke. Listen, if if you like this board, that's fine. You're allowed to like it, okay? Like maybe you like the design, you like all that. But the price they're asking for is a fucking it, it's it, it's fucking it's clown shoes, dude. It's clown shoes and like honky nose. Like it's that level. They're fucking clowns for pricing it at this price point. To be fair, it's Vietnam, and Vietnam are, you know, they're still chasing hype, unfortunately, uh, because the people in the hobby in Vietnam, not all of them, but like the normies there have disposable income and very low IQ. So like, it's perfect for them. 316 stainless is medical grade. There's no such thing as medical grade or surgical grade. I mean, there is, but only for storage, not for tools. For tools, tools are thrown away after one use. So like the grade doesn't fucking matter. It's like if you say like aerospace grade aluminum, every aluminum is aerospace grade. Just like every steel is surgical grade. And all fucking encryption is military grade. Over V... W. Over V W. Wait. Okay. Okay, that's just really weird kerning. Oh, it's not kerning. It's the... The boundary on the container here is fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. Where's your block? Yeah, there's your block. You fucked up your block. You should let your block go a little bit wider because some people might zoom in. Some people are on smarter, smaller devices. You don't give a fuck about that, but you want to fucking charge $1,250 for something that should cost, like... 400. How do you know web dev, bro? I know things. I'll have you know that I, I know many things. Who the fuck keeps ping? Oh, it's Kate. Kate's cool. No, I do. I, I cannot code, but I can read code and understand. Even 400 is a bit much. Well, look, no, like to be fair, like 400 for this, like Decent sized weight, a little bit of complexity. Okay, they gave a little bit of a fuck. You know, 400, like 420 if you're pushing it, you know? Yeah, but no, please, please. I mean, everybody that's watching this knows. Like, that's a fucking hilarious, like, a hilariously bad deal. Fuck that. Like, everybody watching knows that, but the problem is, like, people that, like, don't watch and don't know this shit are probably gonna pay that much. And, like, yeah, they might enjoy their keyboard, but they paid, like, two to three times what they should have for it. I think MLQ was, uh, 300? Alright, we've got the Tourmaline keyboard display stand. Ooh! Okay, that looks like it's gonna scratch the shit out of my boards. Tourmaline. Keyboard display stand. That is so small. My... My palms literally got sweaty within the first two seconds of looking at that picture. I just imagined like my like my nice boards just yeeting themselves off the stand. Bro, that is scary thin. Hello to everyone. After a successful IC, oh, I didn't see it. We launched a group buy which has already begun and will continue until January 31st. The approximate production time is three to four months. Three to f okay, it's a lot bigger than it looks. Okay. Okay, okay. It looked really small, but like, now that I see it in perspective next to something else, it looks a lot bigger. That's a, that's a pro tip for all you boys out there. <sighs> okay, and it comes in a fancy box that I'm gonna throw away the second I get it. That means this is overpriced, right? Right? Okay, to be honest, Assuming you're making like 50 to 100 units max, that's not bad. That's not bad. I'm, I'm comparing this 
to the artisan holder that was $67. This is a lot bigger. It's got more parts and it comes in a fancy box. Like I would personally never buy this, but, but wait, laser cut, processed on a milling machine, bent on a bending, yeah, okay. Wait, you laser that? What kind of fucking laser are you using, buddy? Okay, wait, wait. Laser cut, processed on a milling machine, bent on a bending machine and sandblasted, then powder painted. So it's powder coat. So first they laser it. Yeah, you, you can see that it's not machined, it's bent because you see it gets thinner right at, the, uh, right at the bend where the pressure was applied by the machine. So it's lasered bent aluminum. That is really fucking interesting. Okay, that, like, it should be cheaper. If you're lasering, bending, and powder coating, it should be a little bit cheaper than this. By like the tiniest bit. And then the bottom is fully milled, sandblasted, so that means CNC, and the upper is CNC, sandblasted, and powder coated. So the upper holder is like, that? Dude, I don't fucking know. Would it be that much expensive if it was straight up CNC? Not. It might get annoying for uh, for this bottom bit. Because you'd have to... If, if you were trying to do it in a three or like a three plus one axis, like it might be a pain in the ass. If you're doing it in a five axis, it'll be like easy peasy. Anyway. I'm gonna very, very, very hesitantly give it a buy because like it's not bad. Like it's it's pretty it's pretty fucking snazzy. Like in terms of like keyboard stands, this like takes the cake for like the nicest keyboard stand I have seen to date. Like it's nice. There's there's good shit there. This picture makes it look so small. But yeah, I need like 11 or 12 more stands because I have a keyboard problem. And like, I, I literally like, they're like, I can't even afford to like buy $20 stands because that's like $220. Half uh, scrim, thank you for the 15 months. Oh, oh, okay, we did it. Yeah. All right, I let's have a tiny bit of whiskey to see what Kate said. I fucking love okay. knobs. Uh, everybody that's in Kate's server, I, I need you to harass her into streaming today. It's very important that she streams today. And she's trying to, she's trying to pussy out. Get a 3D printer, then you can print infinite stands. True, true. But a 3D printer takes up space and I wouldn't want filament, I'd want resin, which is gonna smell like ass and be really hard to deal with and is incredibly dangerous with a cat in the house. Again, I don't have space. So yeah. Uh, Simon, what are your thoughts on these switches from Novel Keys? It's not in the recap sheet or today's link. It's a unique, can, can you hold on to that until after we do the rest of the Discord submissions? Hold on to it. Uh, 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 she's streaming tomorrow? No, she's supposed to stream today. Resin is also small? True, but like, dude, I, I have a space problem. Put the printer at my office storage? Yeah, maybe, maybe. All right, let's go. Milky Way and Kanada Keys moment. I hope everyone is enjoying their sets. I have absolutely loved seeing everyone's photos of this set. Unfortunately, after nine months since the group by closing, almost five months of persistent communication, I still haven't been paid the entirety of the designer fee owned to be by Milky Way. If anyone knows how to get a hold of John, if anyone is considering running a keycap set with Milky Way, be aware you're gonna get cut. No shit, buddy. Woo. I'm sorry, like, I'm sorry you got cut. I, it's, it's still funny though. It's still funny though. Uh, 
Uh, I mean, hey, listen, shit happens. Is, is that like a... Aren't Kate supposed to run a Milky Way set? Yes. To be fair, like, it, it is Chinese New Year's, so like... Oh my god, there's so much. Bro, I, I don't give a fuck about, like, reading DMs. I got better shit to do. John left the company. If he spots to Milky Way, it would be sorted. I, I got half of that. All right, Jane V2, CE, gotcha. Happy Lunar New Year. The yellow Jane we've teased is a prototype Jane by Sam. We raffled for a good cause. Okay. Raffled or like, like auction. This is a paid raffle for one Jane. The raffling will be held at the time of posting. All the proceeds go to my... Oh, you buy the raffle ticket. Okay. How much is it? Okay, they're... Wait. What is that? That's Malaysian... Uh... Bring it? I assume. So that's like three dollars? No, that's less. That's like a dollar. Well, it says 30. 420? 2.6? Which one is it? Okay, so it's less than... It's like three bucks. That's not bad. 420? Blaze it. Okay. I mean, it's nice. It goes to charity. Does does all of it go to charity? All the proceeds gathered will be used for charity. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. I appreciate that. Like, if you're ever, like, you know, get a cash grab, like, always, like, cash grab for, like, a good cause or for giveaways or for charity. Like, I'm down with that. Wait, it's RMB, not RM? Wootomation. Wootomation? Woody Macros! Yay! You did the thing that QMK did in 2015. Woo. And it requires custom software. Woo. Bro, I don't get people that fucking do this. Like, I don't get people that, like, just write their own firmware and have their own, like, their own fucking UI. Like, why, bro? Why? Why? Just... Just, just, like... Just contribute to the pre-existing open source, unless you're a dick. Gamers rejoice? Gamers use wooting boards? No, they don't. Gamers use SteelSeries or, or, or Razer Black Widow... Optical Tournament Edition RGB TKL 65. Wait. Support for Windows 10, 11 and most Linux. So no Mac, no Mac. You know what works everywhere? Via. You know what works everywhere? Via L. You know what works everywhere? QMK. You know what else works everywhere? TMK. Gamers now using the Wooting 60 because of all the tech tubers shilling it. Honestly, honestly, you know what the best gaming keyboard is? You know what the best fucking gamer like gaming keyboard is? It's like a ten dollar Microsoft fucking like uh, like membrane board. It's so much fucking better than mechanical. Mechanical is shit for fucking gaming. I I I, I don't get that like. Everybody on Earth was brainwashed by, like, Cherry. And Cherry fucking marketing. Like, objectively, Mechanical is so much worse for games because you need to travel so far to actuate and then you need to reset for it to actuate. And then, oh, but Simon, but if you go with Optical, then you don't have that problem. Spy a membrane board! Spy a membrane board! It's, 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 it's the Apple dilemma of... We created our own problem, and now here is the solution to that problem. And everybody's like, oh, thank you so much, Daddy Tim Cock, for, for the solution to the problem you gave us. You're, you're the best. Yeah, fuck this. Honestly, fuck this. 
friend of mine, Osupro, recently got his winning. He says it's way better for gaming and he builds mechanical keyboards as a service. Okay, so the guy that builds keyboards is telling people that the keyboards that he's building are, are good for gaming. Honestly, I just want the Razer. I just want the Razer. I love Razer, it's so good. You plug it into your computer and like you, you could be rocking a fucking 7950X 16 core processor and you plug it in and your PC just completely locks up for like a solid 15 seconds because it's running things without your permission and then it opens up the Razer Synapse installation like screen. That Razer, bro, it's just so good. All right, Moon TKL V2 update. There was a Moon TKL V2? No, there was. What What about V3? Wait, is, is this V2? Has V2 not fucking moved yet? This was in 2020. You gave V2 an approved buy? Yeah. Yeah, goes to show you. Just never listen to me. Okay, can somebody TLDR? Prox quotes for one board. <laughs> Why is UAE on the list? Why? <laughs> You're such a dick. <laughs> hey, it's as bad as UK. <laughs> at least at least the UK is just as fucked as I am. Wait, it's zeal. Aha. 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 Now it's all fucking coming together. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, th this makes sense. Who is zeal? Right there. That's you. <laughs> like literally every time I think of Zeal, I think of the Monopoly guy. And I think about like the time that like he sold his boards on his store and they were like $3,000 for like, like $200 boards. Like thousand five hundred dollars for like normal sixties. They're like, yeah, good job, bro. You, you're so good at this. All right, Matrix Lab, the Magic Three. Okay, kind of sus. Oh, it's so good. Okay, so it it looks like a two point zero ADD or a three. Sorry, three point zero ADD basically. Fuck, this is so good. Fuck, this is so good. Fuck, I wish I had a Matrix hookup. I have hookups at like so many makers, but not Matrix. Like I could look like, I've lost four, nine, 10 raffles, but like I have the capability to just DM Sam and be like, bro, I've tried so hard to get one. Please just sell me one and he'll sell me one. And I could do that with like a hundred other makers. I would never do it, but I can. I wish I had that fucking hookup with Matrix. And just be like, bro, I fucking need, bro, look at it. It's so good. Look at it. Look at the fucking matrix coding. Bro, Kevin doesn't fucking know me. Oh, look at that. That's so fucking good. Fuck, I love this. I love this. I love this so much. Hey, listen, if anybody has a Matrix hookup, please let me know. 
this is an eyesore? No, but consider you're gonna be looking at the top, right? Like consider like why the top exists and the bottom exists. Top is clean, simple. It's just got like a little, little dash of spice, you know? The bottom has got shit going on, but you're not actively looking at the bottom when you're using it. You're looking at the bottom when you're displaying it. So like win-win. Even top is bad? Wow. Somebody's salty they don't own a matrix board. Unified daughter board update. Is this... Wait, who's... Oh, it's this unified daughter board. Okay. So... S1 slimline daughter board. Wait. Wait. Huh. All right. So you've got the slim and you've got the standard. Okay, there's a lot more going on here. And that's a way better USB port. It's got the plastic back instead of just like the bent back. That's pretty nice. Got your grounding connections. They made it Molex. Yeah, easier to get cables. That's pretty fucking cool. That's pretty fucking cool. I like this. This is my favorite daughter board. Because <coughs> it doesn't eat up so much space and you can always go long instead of needing to go tall with boards. Like you've always got you've always got space for long. You don't always have space for, for tall. But yeah, this is fucking great. Salute. Oh yeah, it's a solid fucking connector. That looks like a hand solder job though. It's not great. Simon, what are your favorite TKL's keyboard? I'm thinking of boards that like I really enjoy using, like specifically me. So like they're not the best TKLs, they're the TKLs I enjoy the most. Hmm. What else do I enjoy TKL as? I do like the K I don't like the KFE. Everybody else likes the KFE. Like I like it, but it's it's not that fucking amazing. What do I like? Ooh, I like the 1.2 OG. 1.2 OG? Fucking on point. Angle? I like the angle. I prefer the Jaguar more. And I prefer Angle's uh, Vertex is 60% over their TKL in terms of feel, personally. It's very different. Do I like the F1 feel? Yeah. Keychron? I mean, no, not for me. Like, they're fucking good, but like, they're not what I, like, they're not boards that like, if I have the option of like 40 boards, like I do, and I want to grab one for the week for the office, then I'm going to reach for, for a Keychron. What would you consider a good F1 build? Uh, I mean, I have mine built plateless with Gateron clears and really shitty springs. So like, it just feels like ass cheeks. A proper build would be like with a plate and with gaskets and everything. GMK sorting machine. Ooh, they hired slaves? Did they hire children? Oh no. It's literally just a sorting machine. Ah, oh, you're still using trays. You're still you you're still fucking using trays. Just use bags. Fuck the planet. They plan to finish all pending projects by September, 2023. And you believe them? You know how many times I've heard GMK promises? Hundreds of times. You know how many times the promises were delivered on? Zero times. They're like 0% success rate. 
I've heard, we are expanding our production line. We are adding more machines. We are gonna go faster. We're upping our quality control. None of that shit fucking happened. None of it. Not a single fucking bit of it happened. It was all a fucking bamboozle. Like eventually people are gonna wake up. People are gonna be like me and just be really cynical and just be like, I don't believe a fucking word you say until you prove it. And then the world would be a better place, you know? If we just never took anyone's word for anything and required evidence, Everything would be amazing. This hobby would be great. Are they genuinely lying? They are genuinely fucking lying. Because if it happens once, it's an accident. If it happens five times, it's bad luck. If it happens a hundred times, it's a fucking pattern and you're doing it on purpose. But yeah, they don't have a problem because idiots keep running key sets with them. Yay, we did it, okay. I will take I will take some links from you boys. So if you have if you have your links, post it in chat. Just post it once. I'll just scroll down and click all the links if you want me to look at particular things. Fun fact, whoever gives me the cloud line first gets banned. Alright, I need more Coca-Cola. I'm all out of cocks. Give me one second. Pretty cool shirt. Oh, thank you. It's a special shirt. Can I show you a China only group buy? Yeah, of course. Yeah. What is it? Is it a Z Frontier link or a Taobao link? No, we take those. We take those. There's a lot of good fucking Chinese projects. I love Chinese projects. GMK has. No, no. I'm aware of the German laws, but you, you know what's a lot better than sending an incredibly wide package that takes up a large amount of space and is really susceptible to like ingress? You get a little box. Okay? Here, watch, 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 watch. I'm going to fucking blow your brains out. Okay? Look what CRP does. They put it in a box. Look how small this fucking box is, okay? I, I was gonna show you like a GMK box, but I threw it in the garbage because it's fucking garbage. Just put it in a small fucking box. There you go, GMK. I saved you millions of dollars. Dumb motherfucking bitches. Yeah, and like reusable bags, there's nothing wrong with reusable bags. I've gotten plenty of shit from Germany that uses reusable bags. Ah, okay. All right, let me start clicking some links. La 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 la. I click you, I click you. I scroll down, I click you. I click you, I scroll down. I click you, I... Oh, that's it, okay. Dots in reusable bags would be a nightmare? Why? Do you not know your profiles? It's not hard to feel them out. It's like, <coughs> it's like using blanks. Just gotta get the right profile and you're good. How hard will I be cucked if I post my own IC? I don't know, you tell me. <laughs> Would there be reasons for me to, to cuck you? Simon, I have never used Taobao or Z Frontier. Any advice if I ever wanted to participate in China only group buys? That's that's advanced China skills. Even I'm not at that level yet. My level is I, I, I take out my, my croissant and I call my Chinese friend. I'm like, yo bro, you gotta fucking buy this for me. And he does. 
But yeah, that's advanced China. Like I can I can do like if it's something from Taobao, I can buy it using Super Buy. If it's something from Xianyu, then same thing. But I can't do like proper group buys. Yeah, you, you need a Chinese friend. Like in China. Get Chinese girlfriend, easy. Also true. All right, let's check out your links. All right, first one is the Kino Y8 kit. Okay, so it's happening now. Oh, I remember this. We looked at this. I, I, I really fucking like this. So this is like oven baked, like finishing, which is like, ooh. And this is like super heavy, right? 2.7 kilos, which means built. It's about on par with an F1. Okay, I like this. I like this version. This version, pretty fucking dope. Like I know it's Wook Studio and I know Wook Studio generally makes like cheaper stuff, but like 400 bucks for like a nice like bitchin case that's like proper like oven heat treated. Oh, it's pretty lit. One millimeter PCB and four pieces of foam. Just don't use the foam. Easy. Fucking easy, bro. Come on. Just, just don't put the foam. And to be fair, like even the standard edition has a big fucking weight. So that's pretty dope. It is pretty dope. Look at all the vendors. Bro, where's sand keys? Feels fucking bad. Wouldn't trust them with a 400 US dollar keyboard? Absolutely, neither would I. But some things in life are worth fucking risking it for the biscuit, okay? And this is one of those things where I would personally risk it for the biscuit just based on like how bitchin' that looks. I would risk it for that biscuit. I absolutely fucking would. And it's a 50-50 shot, I'd get cucked or not, but I would risk it for that biscuit because nobody's done it before. It just looks so cool. All right, next we have cream clicky switches. Introducing our mechanical keyboard switch featuring a unique Staple cap system that produces a satisfied click with every keystroke. Utilizes a stem that strikes the cap. What? 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 Explain to me the clicking mechanism. See the video? I'll put it in the list. We'll watch it after everything else. What do you mean the stem hits the keycap? Are these two separate parts? Are there two stems that move independently? It's kind of sus, all right. Elpa. Oh, you think I'm gonna ban you? You think I'm gonna ban you? See, he's 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 trying to be fucking smart. He's trying to be fucking smart because he's trying to get out of the basement. He's not getting out of the basement. No. No, you're here forever. 
Nice try, buddy. Nice try. Uh, oh, this is this is the laws. I mean, there's there's lots of ways around the laws. There's lots of ways around the laws. Like laws are meant to be bent. That's why laws exist. That's why they're written down. So you can figure out a way to like you know, like navigate around them. Like it it, it drives me fucking crazy that GMK spent so much money on such a fucking poor idea. Just put it just put it in a box. What is my op opinion on the Alpine 65? It's the best keyboard ever. All right, we have the Sussy 80. What is it actually? Oh, we've seen this, the, the Don 80. If I remember correctly, we saw like early ICs of this. Oh yeah, I remember this. So people have gotten their units? As a plastic manu, they have to have any plastic packaging they produce I fucking turn to them love by nuts. law. Okay, that, that's a really, really shitty way of dealing with it. Because what you could do is include reusable plastic packaging that nobody would ever send back. All right, show me, show me the butt. I wanna see the butt. That's not the button. That actually looks pretty fucking good. Honestly, that looks pretty fucking good. Like this was relatively cheap, right? If I remember correctly, like it was kind of like sussy cheap. Ooh, it's pretty dope. All right, this was what, like the, oh no, that's a different board. Yeah. Like, like this is a bitch in fucking photo. Like all these are bitch in photos. I remember looking at this and like enjoying it. Although it was very, 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 very stereotypically Chinese. Ooh, it's spicy. It's the best kind of spicy. Which one would you recommend to get a V1, uh, an F1 or a Matrix The Magic 3? Uh, get, get, get the Geon board. The, the, the Matrix board is very bad. You shouldn't try for it. <laughs> I do like this. Would I ever buy this? No. This is like the most hideous thing ever, but I love it. Somebody put Mao's head as a joke for the wave, did they? It's probably not gonna be on Sea Frontier, is it? It's okay, I believe you. All right. All right, let me get my, uh, my hearing device. It was on Z Frontier, holy shit. Man likes to live dangerously. Better be careful, it might go super hard on Z Frontier and start banning like the number four. What is this song? Uh, this song is Play No Games by uh, NBHD Nick. Man plays no games. All right. Oh yeah. oh yeah, that feels good. Cough. All right. Hey, what's up? Thanks for stopping back by the channel. Today we're taking a look at Novel Key's new cream clicky switches. They come in packs of 36 switches per box. Because of course they do, because fuck you. Why would you have a normal fucking amount? Like 36 is not enough for a board. 72 is not enough for a TKL. And then you end up with 108. You gotta buy one away if you wanna do a TKL's worth. It's literally the loot box, like, like, like fake premium in-game currency model. Fuck you. You heard me, Mike. Use, use normal sizes, please. Consider that.
Like, you're not helping anybody but yourself, and we all know that. They're also this really nice dark brown color and are very smooth for a clicky switch. That sounds like, I'm not gonna say, because you guys are gonna go buy it. That sounds like a very, very obscure, rare switch that I really enjoy. When we take it apart, you can see there's a metal disc in the bottom housing. I'm I not very- So there's like a clicker housing. in the bottom when you like fully bottom familiar out. familiar with how this is constructed from a technical standpoint, but whatever's happening inside of this switch is magical. So we went ahead and threw these into my stock Nebula Pink NK87 Aluminum Edition for a sound test. I think these switches will be perfect for anyone who likes a vintage sound on their keyboard and games heavily. Let me know your thoughts. And games Here's heavily. Test. Oh god. Oh god, your build just sounds terrible. Like, the switches could theoretically sound good. Why does this sound like oh, ass cheeks? Fucking love knobs oh there's foam in there what the fuck well there's a novel keys affiliate link so yeah it's sponsored one way or another oh look the top recommended video is the black salmon video for keyboard soldering and desoldering for beginners oh you can't see it i'm in the way fat ass is in the way look it's me that's me my video. Yeah. It has 40 times more views than this. Whee! <sighs> okay, somebody asked a question. Uh, no, they didn't. Permeability, thank you for the 27 months, King Friday. Thank you for the 21 months. After watching that video, I bought a $200 soldering iron. I mean, you can if you want. Yeah, no, like, those switches unironically sound decent if you get them into the right build. Like, DCS caps, absolutely, on, like, on, like, a leaf spring plate. Preferably, like, aluminum leaf spring plate. And then, like, if you want to, like, deepen, like, the reverb a little bit, you can have, like, internal brass. Ooh, that would hit hard. I bought a new iron and it keeps electrocuting me. You don't have good uh, ground or earth in your power lines. So like check your power strip and be really, really careful. You want to make sure that you're grounding. It's very important to have all your shit grounded at home. Okay, it's real DBO key. There's 54K views. All right. The mechanical keyboard is loud, question mark. Ah, uh, one second. My subtitles are in Korean by default. This is the sound of the iPhone keyboard. Who the fuck has sounds? Just... Oh, fuck yeah, membrane. Where's my nut button? Bro, I don't know where it is. Found it. You want to try a NIS board? No, you don't. Uh, all right, listen. If you think you want to try a NIS board, uh, hop on like uh, Mercari.jp, right? And then fucking like. In, in the search box, type real force. I know, I'm, I'm giving out the big secrets. And then like, just, just, just fucking just, just buy this. Like, look at this. Look at this. Real force, TKL. And it's like brand new because like like Japanese used is like US like new in box. Here's one for like 120 bucks, bro. 
get one of those. Just like buy like a JIS, just to like try Topra. And if you like it, then you can harvest all the parts from it and put it into another build. So yeah, do that. Do that. The market is dry right now for R1. Don't worry about it. Also, yeah, my, my desk is in shambles because the last stream we had, I was like building a server. So like there's random shit everywhere. Oh God, this sounds terrible. I can hear only the springs. Did the server end up working? You bet your ass it did. Look at it go. Look at the server go. There's a NAS on there. There's my piracy server. There's my home assistant server, my pie hole. And I partially set up my uh, uh. Uh. There. I have 36 terabytes, but I'm about to double it next week, so we're good. Where's the cats in hats directory? Right there. Is 900 to 1,000 G on F1s a lot in terms of a keyword group buy? Yes, it is. Will I be able to get one the moment that it gets on sale? I mean, you can most certainly try. A lot of other people are gonna be trying. I think his Discord server is like 20,000 people. Yeah, 26,000. 26,000. I, okay, I, I say this very lightly and like, don't hold me to it. I might try to do something like I did for the frog when the frog came, came out and I knew that like people were gonna struggle to get it. I asked Gian to hold on to a couple of units for me to give slots to people in the server that needed it. So like people that didn't have a solid first board or anything like that, like it went to them. So I might consider doing something like that for uh, the F1 V2, maybe. But again, it would be specifically for people that we can background check and know that like they don't have any other decent boards, so we hook them up. Oh God, I hate this so much. I hate this so much. Bro, type on a fucking buckling spring with a solenoid. Do it, do it, do it. Just fucking go hard, bro. Why is the membrane bro board the best looking one? Dude, membrane is good. It's totally fucking fine. Model M is membrane. That's what the M stands for. Dude, unironically, like I, I, I've tried like a uh, like a stock Samsung keyboard, like an OEM PC keyboard, and like it was a very particular model from a very particular year. I swear that shit was more tactile than Topra. Like obviously, like the construction was dog shit. The caps wobbled all over the place, but the domes were fucking on point. Thank you, DBO. I like you. DBO is great. DBO is great. Okay, so I promised you guys a Gator Dance for free, but I get to pick the song, okay? I get to pick the song.
Ram Ranch? No, I get to pick. <coughs> Cough. It is that. It's gotta be rock solid, right? Is it? Let's find out. It is. Oof. Okay. Let's fucking go. Oh, we got a gator kiss. All right. So let's do the gator dance. Let me finish this whiskey. Fuck, the stream is so short. Ah. All right, let's go. Sea shanty. Okay, I said I get to pick. That means I get to pick, not you guys. All right, am I ready for this? Are we ready for this? I don't know if we're ready for this. Are you guys ready for this? Give me, give me a Ron peek in chat if you're ready for this. Let me see the Ron. If I see enough Rons, I think, I think you're ready for this. All right, Paul gave us a Ron. Uh. You don't like sea shanty? I love sea shanty. <laughs> Okay, that's that's a good amount. All right, let's go.
Oh. Oof. All right. How was that? Was that a good gator dance? If that was, if 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 that was a good gator dance, I expect at least a cheer of one bit. Okay. You just made my tactiles clicky. It's kind of sus. Oh. Ooh. Oh, God damn. Hey, thank you for the 100 oh, titties. Damn it. That's Stop giving me 100 times more than I asked for. Also, Fran, thank you for redeeming Simon Sells Out. Uh, those of you that are still in the stream, after watching a grown man I dance with an alligator. Love knobs. Uh, you may not know this, but like, this is like a really weird stream where like, we don't have sponsors. Oh, I don't take free shit cut. from people. Uh, like, I, people don't give me like, people don't sponsor like my reviews or like get to tell me what I say or what I think. And yeah, yeah. And it's, all, it's also a not-for-profit stream where like, the money that comes in, like I can't use it to like buy alcohol or like furniture or like clothes or rent or electricity or alcohol. Did I mention alcohol? It all needs to be spent on the stream specifically. And it goes to like good giveaways and like wholesome shit like that once in a while. You know, most of the time, you know, we're, we're buying, you know, very expensive camera jigs so I can move the camera up and down so you guys can have very high quality macro cam. But yeah, I mean, listen, if, if, if you like the content that you see on this channel, first and foremost, just watch, you know, I don't necessarily ask for people to like, give me money. Like, I don't, I don't want the money. I don't need the money. I don't stream for the money. I stream because I want to, and I've been streaming because I want to for what, like 36 months now. It's pretty cool. Ah, so logics and Logics, thank you for the titties. Frothy, thank you for the sub. Uh, Idear, thank you for the 111 titties. Ah. I was enjoying the dance, but a croissant got in the way. Yeah, but it's a magic croissant. It like goes bright and then like uh, uh, turns off. And then like cream clicky internals. Oh shit. Oh, I already unplugged my thing. All right, one second. This is uh, cream cookies. I fucking love knobs. Yeah, yeah. They sound like what I think they sound like. They sound pretty good. Like, I like that. I like the, 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 like the very sharp, very instant click, you know? I like that. And Mixie, thank you, by the way, for the 27 months. Ah, oh, okay. Well, what, 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 what do we do? What do we do now? Wah. Wah. Is anybody streaming? No, of course not. Why would anybody fucking stream keyboards? Box white like clicks are the best kind of clicks. I'm not the biggest fan of click bar clickies. But there are good click bars. Arc review when? I mean, I, I'm da I'm re dailying it at the office now, so like a couple weeks probably. I mean, I can save you the hassle of it's fucking great, but wait for round two. So, do what you're going to do on Wednesday. Oh, and the stream. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right, let's see if somebody's streaming right now. <sighs> Twitch.tv. Makers and crafting. Wait, I, I saw something keyboard. There's a keyboard. Hey. Somebody's building a keyboard. Hello. R O G R N, maybe a few TX packs. Nice. Okay. Oh it is. Dang. Yeah, see I guess I've gotten lucky. Yeah. I've ordered a bunch from Divinity and then I Alright. He's telling the story about how he got cucked. Love it. That's you know he's a he's a true enthusiast, okay? Are you truly ever really in this hobby if you're not getting cupped from like all directions? Anyway, thank you all for watching. I'll see you on Monday. Also, there will be a YouTube video tomorrow. Okay, so like youtube.com slash Black Simon. Don't miss it. If you miss it, I'm going to be really sad. Okay.
But yeah, let's let's go cuck this guy. Uh, I expect uh, Simon Detectives and only Simon Detectives, okay? And nothing else. Don't even say hi. Just Simon Detective. Everything he says, Simon Detective. I'll be with you. I'm joining you for this. Whoa, what's going on? Oh my God. <laughs> Black Simon, hi. Holy shit. <laughs> wow. Thank you so much for the raid, man. I just built a uh, 